Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we are going to crochet a flower granny square pattern. So this pattern is very beautiful and very interesting to make. So let's begin our project by making a magic circle. After completing the magic circle, we are going to up a chain 2. Now we have worked our chain 2. Now we are going to work 16 double crochets into the magic circle. So yarn over, insert into the magic circle, grab the yarn, pull up a loop, 3 loops in the hook, come out of 2 loops, again come out of 2 loops. This will be our first double crochet. So place marker in top of the double crochet. Again into the magic circle we are going to work 15 more double crochets. So work 15 more double crochets into the magic circle. Now we have completed working our 16 double crochets. Let's count it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. After completing the 16 double crochets, pull the tail end to close the magic circle. Now remove the marker and work a slip stitch. So into the very first double crochet we are going to work a slip stitch. Now for the round 2 we are going to work a chain 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. The first chain will consider as our first single crochet. So place marker in the first chain. Now skip the next chain. So this is our next chain and work one single crochet in this chain. Again work a chain 3 and skip the next chain and work one single crochet in this chain. So this is the pattern of this round. Work a chain 3, skip the next chain and into the very next chain we are going to work a single crochet. Pause the video, continue the same pattern throughout the round. I will be meeting you in the end of this round. Now we are in the end of this round. Here we will have one chain to skip and we are going to slip stitch in the single crochet. That is the very first chain of this round. So remove the marker and we are going to work a slip stitch. So there will be 8 repetition. That is the chain 4 for 8 times. So we can check before going to the next round. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So for the next round, we are going to work a slip stitch into the chain 4. And we are going to work a chain 1 and a single crochet into the same space. And we are going to place the marker on top of the single crochet. And into the very next chain 3 space, we are going to work 6 double crochets. Yarn over, insert the hook into the chain 3 space, grab the yarn, pull up a loop, come out of 2 loops, again come out of 2 loops. Again yarn over, insert into the chain 3 space, work a double crochet. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 6 and into the very next chain we are going to work a single crochet. Again into the next chain 3 space we are going to work 6 double crochets. So 1, 
two, three, four, five, six. So six in total. So in this row or in this round, this is the pattern. Six double crochet in chain three space and into the very next chain three space we will be working one single crochet. So into the next chain three space of a single crochet. So into the next chain three space of six double crochet. Again one single crochet, six double crochet. So repeat the pattern. I will be meeting you in the end of this round. So now we are in the end of this round. We are going to remove the marker and work a slip stitch. After slip stitching, work a chain 1 and turn the arc and into the single crochets. We are going to work front post single crochet. So into the single crochet of the previous round, we are going to work single crochet that is front post single crochet. Okay. So after working a chain 1, we are going to work a front post single crochet. So we are inserting the needle from behind and pull the yarn to the single crochet and we are going to work a single crochet that is front post single crochet. Here we are going to place our marker. Now we are going to work a chain 4, 1, 2, 3, 4 and into the next single crochet we are going to work a front post single crochet. So we are going to insert the needle from behind, grab the yarn, 2 loops in the hook come out of 2 loops. Again we are going to work a chain 4 and into the next single crochet we are going to work front post single crochet. So insert the yarn sorry insert the needle from behind the single crochet pull the yarn through the single crochet there will be two loops in the hook come out of two loops again work a chain four and insert the hook behind the single crochet pull the yarn two loops in the hook come out of two loops like this repeat the pattern throughout the round so there will be eight repetition so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. We are going to slip stitch in the single crochet. After slip stitching, we are going to work a chain 3. So 1, 2 and 3. We are going to turn the arc. After working the chain 3, we are going to turn the arc. Okay, like this. And into the chain 4 space, we are going to work 7 double crochet. So yarn over, insert the hook, grab the yarn, come out of 2 loops, again come out of 2 loops. Here we are going to work 7 more double crochets. So this will be our first double crochet. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Again, into the next chain 4 space, we are going to work a single crochet. Again, into the next chain 4 space, we are going to work a double crochet. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So into the next chain 4 space of a single crochet. So like this repeat the pattern into the next chain 4 space of 8 double crochet and into the very next chain 4 space of single crochet. So repeat the pattern throughout the round. I will be meeting you in the end of the round. Now we are in the end of this round. We are going to slip stitch in top of the chain 3. Again, we are going to work a chain 2 and turn the project. In the single crochets, we are going to work front post single crochet. So here, we are going to work a front post single crochet. Again, we are going to work a chain 4, 1, 2, 3, 4 and place marker in top of the single crochet. 
again here into the single crochet or a friend post single crochet or a chain four one two three four again into the next single crochet or a friend post single crochet again or a chain four one two three four and again into the next single crochet or one friend post single crochet like this repeat the pattern throughout the round so chain four and friend post single crochet on single crochet okay continue the pattern so now we are in the end of this round so there will be eight repetitions of chain and friend post single crochets so count it one two three four five six seven eight including this so remove the marker and we are going to work a slip stitch after slip stitching we are going to work a chain one and cut the extra yarn out now we have completed our flower now we are going to work our leaf make a slip knot and we are going to insert in any one of the chain four space and we are going to work a cluster 3dc cluster so we are going to work a chain two and into the same chain space yarn over insert grab the yarn pull up a loop come out of two loops again yarn over insert into the same space grab the yarn pull through come out of two loops now three loops in the hook come out of all three loops now we are going to work a chain three and into the same space we are going to work double crochet cluster so yarn over two times insert grab the yarn pull it through come out of two loops again come out of two loops yarn over two times insert grab the yarn pull through come out of two loops again come out of two loops again yarn over two times insert grab the yarn pull through come out of two loops again come out of two loops again come out of all four loops now again work a chain three and here we are going to work three dc cluster that is three double crochet cluster yarn over insert grab the yarn pull through come out of two loops again yarn over insert grab the yarn pull through come out of two loops again yarn over insert through grab the yarn pull through come out of two loops now come out of all four loops now again work a chain four after working a chain four we are going to work a single crochet into the next chain four space after working a single crochet we are going to work a chain four one two three four and into the next chain four space we are going to work three double crochet cluster chain three three triple crochet cluster chain three and again three double crochet cluster so yarn over insert into the next chain four space grab the yarn pull through come out of two loops again yarn over insert into the next insert into the same chain space grab the yarn pull through come out of two loops again yarn over insert grab the yarn pull through come out of two loops now come out of all four loops again work a chain three and into the same chain space work a double crochet cluster yarn over twice come out of two loops again come out of two loops yarn over twice come out of two loops again come out of two loops yarn over twice come out of two loops again come out of two loops there will be four loops left alone come out of all four loops work a chain three again work a triple double crochet three double crochet cluster so we have completed working three double crochet cluster chain three three triple crochet cluster chain three and a three double crochet cluster now work a chain four into the next chain four space work a single crochet again work a chain four and into the next chain four space work the same pattern that is three double crochet cluster three chain three triple crochet cluster three chain three double crochet cluster so yarn over insert 
grab the yarn pull through come out of two loops again yarn over insert come out of two loops yarn over insert come out of two loops now come out of all four loops okay chain three or three triple crochet cluster yarn over twice come out of two loops again come out of two loops yarn over twice come out of two loops again come out of two loops yarn over twice come out of two loops again come out of, now come out of all four loops again chain three yarn over insert come out of two loops yarn over insert now we have completed our three double crochet cluster okay chain four what one single crochet into the next chain chain four now we are going to work the same pattern that is three double crochet cluster chain three three triple crochet cluster chain three three double crochet cluster Now we have completed three double crochet chain three, three triple crochet cluster chain three, three double crochet cluster. Now walk a chain four, one two, three four. Now into the next chain four space walk a single crochet again walk a chain four, one two three four, and into the cluster we are going to slip stitch. So in top of the cluster we are going to slip stitch. Now walk a chain one and cut the extra yarn. So now we have completed our leaf part. Now we are going to work the edges. So we are going to take the brown yarn, make a slip knot. So we are going to insert in the chain four part. Work a chain three. One, two, three. Yarn over, work a double crochet. Again, work a double crochet. Now here, we are going to work three double crochet in the chain three space. So yarn over, first double crochet into the same chain space, second double crochet, and into the same space, third double crochet. So here, after completing the three double crochet, in top of the three triple crochet cluster we are going to work the corner so yarn over insert work a double crochet again into the same space work a double crochet now work a chain two again into the same space in top of the three triple crochet we are working two more double crochets so in top of the triple crochet we work Two double crochet, chain two, two double crochet. Again, into the next chain three space, we are working three double crochet. So one, two, three. Again, into the next chain four space of three double crochet. One, two, three. Again into the next chain four space or three double crochet. One, two, three. Again we have reached our corner. So into the chain three space here we are working three double crochet. One, two, and three. In top of the triple crochet cluster we are working the corner. So two double crochet, one, Two, two double crochet, chain two, and two double crochet. One, two. 
So this will be our corner. And into the next chain 3 space, again we are working 3 double crochet. 1, 2 and 3. So we, ha we have worked 2 corners. So this is the pattern. In the chain 4 and chain 3 space, we are working 3 double crochet. And in top of the 3 triple crochet cluster, we are working 2 double crochet, chain 2, 2 double crochet. So repeat the same pattern. I will be meeting you in the end of this round. So now we are in the end of this round. We are going to slip stitch in top of the chain 3. So 1, 2 and 3. In top of the chain 3, we are going to slip stitch. After slip stitching, work a chain 1 and cut the extra yarn out. After completing, weave in all the extra yarn using the blunt needle. So friends, I hope you really like this video. Give it a try. If you are new to this video, subscribe my channel and click the bell icon for the notification. Thanks for watching. Again, I will be meeting you in the next video. Until then, take care and bye-bye.